You're watching KXAN Austin News at 6. Here in Austin today, the State Board of Education approved a controversial resolution warning textbook makers to watch it when it comes to religions. Several conservative members of that board felt there was a heavy pro-Islam slant and a negative view of Christianity. Today's decision could determine what your children read when a new round of textbooks goes out across the state in 2014. That's topping our news at 6 o'clock tonight. KXAN's political reporter Josh Hinkle was there for that heated vote and its aftermath. This resolution sends a real warning to textbook makers. If you're unbalanced when it comes to religious references, we're probably not going to buy your books. Yes, it did single out Islam versus Christianity, so board members against that idea tried everything to change the focus. Delay the vote, add amendments, but in the end, the resolution passed in its original and controversial form. Resolution is adopted 7 to 6. So controversial, so confusing, and undoubtedly conservative. It took four hours to decide none of that mattered. This religion resolution would go through just the way it had been written, despite the pleas of many at the Texas State Board of Education meeting. It's hard not to conclude that the misleading claims in this re resolution are either based on ignorance of what's in the textbooks or on the other hand, are an example of fear-mongering and playing politics. The specific religious references said textbooks, which TEA said were phased out a decade ago, favored Islam and cast Christianity in a negative light. This resolution is a one versus the other. The four Republican board members who submitted the resolution would not back down on keeping those examples, despite attempts from the rest of the board to encompass all religions, not just a few. Then it sends a strong signal out there that that block of members members of the board is still functioning in a very strong way. The entire board agreed it needed to warn textbook makers to better balance their future religious references. Ensuring up front that some of these potential imbalances or potential biases are taken care of before they ever reach the textbook review stage at the end. The textbook publisher representatives were in the audience today. They got the message loud and clear that if you're going to have textbooks in Texas, they better be accurate, they better be balanced, they better treat the religions fairly. Some members wanted more research into the textbooks the resolution claimed to bias. Some wanted to amend the resolution to take out those references altogether. But in the end, the original conservative approach prevailed 7 to 6, leaving some members doubting the future direction of textbooks in Texas. I will not be able to support this resolution. I won't be voting uh, for this resolution. Keep in mind, this resolution is not binding, meaning they can't force a textbook maker to keep certain references out. It's just a way to let them know the board is watching as it makes the decision of which books should go to Texas students. Live in the studio, Josh Hinkle, KXAN, Austin News.